Hello YouTube, it's Wes. Uh, I've got the 25 caliber Avenge X back out. Got some new slugs, some FX hybrids, uh, 26 grain. Figured I'd do a couple five shot groups and keep it short and sweet. Of course you know what I run and we'll get some numbers and then I'm gonna see since I bumped everything up how fast the atomics are going since how they are 0.6 grains heavier than the slugs see if they shoot any faster or slower or how that's going hopefully they're extremely accurate and we can go maybe do a little squirrel hunt that's very windy today so I don't know if that's gonna happen but I'll see y'all on scope cam First five shot string. Woo! 49 foot pounds energy. say I really like these I didn't do any adjustments 900 wow 11 last bullet oh uh, it shouldn't be the last bullet I bet I set it for four holy moly 11 empty magazine that's 40 yards and these are so accurate. I'm putting out 47 foot pounds. Uh, swap over and get right back with you guys. Should have kept my mouth shut. Nah, no, just kidding. I think that's me moving. Got too excited. Maybe not. Maybe not. I spoke too soon. We're still within that little one inch bullseye, most of them. 909. Empty magazine. The FS Atomics 26.6 grains. Still group well on there. Let's see. Well, didn't get that all on there, so we'll start again. Nine hundred nineteen. Wow, that's putting fifty foot pounds of energy on a freaking pellet.
920. They're grouping really good. 917. So, we'll adjust for where they're hitting. Nine hundred sixteen. Just a little bit more. Ooh, too much. Too much. Not quite a millidot. There we go. Yeah, these are smoking out of here. They're... Oop, that was me. 25 caliber. Yeah. Dust some pigeons. Oop, that was it. Alrighty, guys. Thanks for watching. And we'll see if we get to go squirrel hunting today. And hopefully, you like this video and subscribe. And I'll see you on the next one. Yeah, as you can see, there's some pretty good results. And I actually did get to go squirrel hunting. And that was a little fella that didn't make it today. <clears throat> so, I'll show you a little comparison between uh, the regular pellet and the one that was halfway down through him. And it's pretty devastating. And you can see all that rifling on that slug. It's definitely putting rifling into it, so... It's it's an amazing gun. Uh, it was lights out. As soon as I pulled the trigger, I'd, I'd say that squirrel couldn't have been more than 50 yards. And that's a pretty good shot for a pellet gun. And it was lights out. So I'm very happy with the results.